What are tax brackets? A tax bracket is a range of income that's taxed at a certain rate. Tax brackets work like this. We'll start with a two column table and in the header we'll put taxable income and tax rate. In the wizarding world, personal income tax is progressive. As your income increases, you gradually move through higher and higher tax brackets, which increases your average tax rate. On the first 10,000 galleons that you earn during a tax year, you pay no tax at all. Then from 10,000 to 40,000 galleons, you're charged 20% tax. Between 40,000 and 100,000, you pay 30% and any taxable income above 100,000 galleons incurs the highest tax rate of 40%. Harry works as an aura for the Ministry of Magic and earned 90,000 galleons during the tax year. How much tax does he owe and what is his tax rate? A common misconception is that Harry would have to pay 30% tax on all of his income. But that's not how progressive tax brackets work. You can think of tax brackets as cauldrons that we fill up with taxable income. We start with the smallest cauldron or the lowest tax bracket and we fill it up right to the top. Harry doesn't pay any tax on this income. Then we fill up the second one. Harry pays 20% on this income. And then we fill up the third one. This time we don't make it all the way to the top because Harry didn't earn 100,000 galleons. He pays 30% tax on his taxable income in this cauldron. So how much tax does Harry owe? Let's jump back to our table where we've added a couple more columns. On Harry's first 10,000 galleons, he pays 0% tax. In other words, nothing. Between 10,000 and 40,000, he's charged 20%. 30,000 multiplied by 20% is 6,000 galleons. And then from 40,000 to his total taxable income of 90,000, he pays 30%. 90 minus 40 is 50 and 50,000 multiplied by 30% is 15,000 galleons. Harry didn't earn over 100,000 galleons, so the bottom line of this table is irrelevant. Overall, Harry owes personal income tax of 0 plus 6,000 plus 15,000, a total of 21,000 galleons in personal income tax. Let's look at this on a chart. As you can see, Tax brackets are progressive. As Harry earns more, his tax rate steps up and up and he pays higher and higher rates of tax. Harry does pay 30% tax, but only on his income above 40,000 galleons. This is his marginal tax rate. It's the highest rate of income tax that he pays. His effective tax rate is his average tax rate across all his taxable income. We can work that out by taking his total income tax payable and dividing it by his total taxable income. That's 21,000 in tax divided by 90,000 in taxable income, which is roughly 23%. The following year, Harry gets promoted to head of the Aura office and receives a pay rise. This increases his salary to 140,000 galleons per year. What impact does this have on his marginal and effective tax rates? Before we jump into the answer, you should know that I've summarized everything I'm talking about in my tax brackets cheat sheet. It's available to buy on my website and the proceeds help keep accounting stuff free from sponsors. The link's in the description. On Harry's first 10,000, he pays nothing, the same as last year. On his next 30,000, he pays 20% tax, which is still 6,000 galleons. But this next tax bracket is a little bit different. Since Harry now earns over 100,000 galleons, he fills this cauldron up to the top. 60,000 multiplied by 30% is 18,000 galleons. 
And finally, Harry pays 40% tax on his income above 100,000 galleons. 40,000 multiplied by 40%, which is 16,000 galleons. His total tax bill is 0 plus 6,000 plus 18,000 plus 16,000, which is 40,000 galleons. If we jump back to the chart, we can see that Harry's marginal tax rate has stepped up by 10%. It's now 40%. But this tax rate only affects his income above 100,000 galleons. His effective tax rate is his total income tax payable of 40,000 divided by his total taxable income of 140,000. That's around 28%, which is only 5% higher than his effective tax rate from last year. Thanks for watching Accounting Stuff and an extra special thanks to my channel members for your ongoing support. As always, if you have any video requests, please let me know. There's a fly here. Please let me know down in the comments and I will see you in the next one.